Hi, it's Toby here from Divorce Lifestyle Design and I wanted to talk to you today about one of my favourite sayings and that is that the bad news is that nothing lasts forever. The good news is that nothing lasts forever. Now that slightly simple paradox uh, represents the fact that things are always changing just like the seasons. Here we are on this beautiful morning in Staffordshire in England and things are changing, you know, the leaves are falling off the trees, it's getting colder, we've had our first or one of the first frosts of the year and things are changing. And that can be unsettling, it can be difficult. You know, some people don't cope well with winter. Some people feel seasonal affective disorder and, and struggle to maintain their optimism. People also struggle with other aspects of change. You know, when you're going through divorce or other times of challenge, it can be unsettling. It can be difficult to handle. Um, the good news is that no matter what you're going through, nothing lasts forever. Difficulties don't last forever. Things get resolved, things move on, times change, people move on, you'll move on. You find strength in the change, you learn from the change, and that enables you to deal with better with the things that come along in the future. So it's a good thing as well, you know, change happens. And I think also in times of change, and also in the changing of seasons, it prompts us to, to maybe take a look at our lives and to, you know, turn over, start afresh, start new things going on, get new things going on in our lives. So myself and my wife, we spent uh, a weekend ago, we spent a lot of time clearing things out, you know, turning out wardrobes, turning out cupboards, tidying up the garage, throwing lots of things away, getting rid of clutter. And the beauty of doing something like that, metaphorically speaking, in our lives is that you discover new things. You discover things you'd forgotten that you had. You discover resilience that you'd forgotten you had, skills that you'd forgotten that you'd had. Um, when we were going through the house, we found things that we'd, we'd forgotten that we had a use for, so, so we, we can make use of them again. We also found things that we no longer need, so we got rid of them. Taking that same approach in our life of, of turning out the things we no longer require, getting rid of them, letting go of them, and actually then rediscovering the things that we know we can make use of, the things that we can um, get positivity out of in our lives, is a great thing. So change in that respect can be a great thing as well, you know, going through the process and us accepting and you know, putting our arms around the process can be a great thing. So I guess my message in all that is to encourage you not just to resist change and not just to look at it as something that's unsettling and a cause of difficulty, but rather a cause of opportunity. Go through some change, uh, enforce some change on yourself in your life. Get sorting things out, get rid of some clutter, get rid of some of the old stuff that you've been hanging on to, whether that's feelings or people or thoughts and, and actually start with the positivity and treat the changing of seasons as a prompt for something new and amazing in your life. So I hope there's some sense in there, I hope it helps you in some way and I hope you're thriving and not just surviving and I'll look forward to seeing you next time. Thank you.